A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Jesus and his disciples came to the other side of the sea, to the territory of the Gerasenes. When he got out of the boat, at once a man from the tombs, who had an unclean spirit, met him. The man had been dwelling among the tombs and no one could restrain him any longer, even with a chain. In fact, he had frequently been bound with shackles and chains. But the chains had been pulled apart by him and the shackles smashed, and no one was strong enough to subdue him. Night and day among the tombs and on the hillside he was always crying out and bruising himself with stones. Catching sight of Jesus from a distance, he ran up and prostrated himself before him, crying out in a loud voice, What have you to do with me, Jesus, Son of the Most High God? I adjure you, by God, do not torment me. He had been saying to him, Unclean spirit, come out of the man. He asked him, What is your name? He replied, Legion is my name. There are many of us. And he pleaded earnestly with him not to drive them away from that territory. Now a large herd of swine was feeding there on the hillside. And they pleaded with him, Send us into the swine, let us enter them. And he let them, and the unclean spirits came out and entered the swine. The herd of about two thousand rushed down a steep bank into the sea, where they were drowned. As he was getting into the boat, the man who had been possessed pleaded to remain with him. But he would not permit him, but told him instead, Go home to your family and announce to them all that the Lord in his pity has done for you. Then the man went off and began to proclaim in the Decapolis what Jesus had done for him, and all were amazed. The Gospel of the Lord There are many of us, the unclean spirit that infests the man admits to Jesus that they are many and so are called legion. Their intention is to wreak havoc in the man. The man is being drowned in a cacophony of voices and doldrums of pain, and seemingly his own respite comes in hurting himself. When Jesus drives out legion, the man is restored to rationality and experiences peace again. Gone are the guilt feelings and the tormenting voices that push the person to insanity and self-destruction. Let us invite Jesus to our life and ask Him to ward off negative voices which torment us.